everybody, and welcome to one of the world's most iconic city, the city by the bay, San Francisco. Today, one of the most iconic and storied college football programs in all of America. City College of San Francisco, 8-1, and one, battling a rivalry down the road. College of San Mateo, 8-1. and one. Hi, everybody. My name is Mike McDowell, along with my friend Todd Spencer. 8-1 and one versus 8-1, and one, a rivalry game. Okay, that's, that's part A. Part B, Notre Dame had New Rocky, Alabama had Paul Bear Bryant, and City College, well... They have a guy by the name of George Rush in his 37th year. He's done a remarkable job. His teams are always winners, and today they're playing for the Bay 6 Conference title game, really. That's pretty exciting, Mike. Uh, All right, welcome back, everybody, to uh, Ram Stadium on the campus of City College in San Francisco. It's number two, San Mateo, versus number three, San Francisco. Justin Watts kicks a ball ball caught at the 10, taken to the 20. City College gets just across the 21-yard line, and it was taken by number four for City College, and that, of course, is our friend Thomas Budenbaugh. We talked about Thomas Budenbaugh, the Hawaii State Sprint Champion. Thomas has a lot of speed. You know, he comes out of Hawaii, and uh, he, he comes here with a lot of speed, a lot to offer on offense and special teams. So we got to keep a good eye on Thomas today. Should have a big ball game. Number two against number three. City College ranked third in the, na- in the uh, state, and San Mateo number two. At quarterback for the City College Rams, the familiar, Tony Rodriguez. Jare Hayes in the backfield. Back to pass at the 30. Caught. Quick pass. Nice strike there. About a uh, six, seven yard gain. Second down. Lost it down on the 35. So the fourth play of the drive. I'm up on the fifth play right now, actually. Just game getting underway from Rams Stadium. Back to pass, plenty of time. Dump off over to Hayes. Hayes, good defensive pursuit by the front seven of San Mateo. That was Malik Meckham, uh, 5'10", 175-pound DB from American Canyon. I would go with Beecham. Beecham. Yes, yes. yes. So, listen, let me uh, – John Ray Hayes is in the backfield. Cole Hickatini along with Maurice McSwain. Offensive line will be A.J. McCollum, Oge Udogu, Connor Brennan, Malik Cervantes Quelar up front. Back to pass, Rodriguez looking downfield, has a receiver, almost picked off, nearly t- the tip ball from McSwain. And number 22 for uh, the Bulldogs, Jordan Shepard, the defensive back, got his hand on it, but just could not quite come up with it. And that's going to co- set up a punting situation for the Rams. Along with Todd Spencer, my name is Mike McDowell. We welcome you to today's game. Third and ten. Burgess in trouble. He's going to get sacked. The Rams defense, good pursuit, and brought down by number 29 for the defense of City College. Isaiah Johnson was one of the tacklers. Yeah, definitely looked like the Rams defense came to play today. And uh, very aggressive. Penetrating through the offensive line. It's a, uh, for San Mateo running game, it's, it's still a little suspect right now. Hashim Boyd will take a deep punt. It's, he's going to go backtrack. He's going to catch it. He, he, ca- he catches it in midair and is brought down. And it was a superb tackle by a couple of Bulldogs, particularly number 11, Elias Vargas. Yeah, that was very dangerous. All right, welcome back. Big classic showdown between. Number two, San Mateo in the state of California. Number three, San Francisco, also ranked in the state of California. Number one and two in Northern California. And yes. Man, the first quarter of play, uh, we said it, we'll say it again, but it, for lack of a better description, it has just been a methodical up-and-down chess match. Up-and-down chess match that even the fans can enjoy. Big crowd here on hand, a lot of blue and a sea of red. Of course, San Francisco in their gray uniforms, red trim, red helmets. San Mateo, all white uniforms, blue numbers. Caught near the 50. Wow, perfect caught by perfect catch and release from Burgess to Lee. And that is a San Mateo first down. San Mateo first down. He took a three-step drop and fired the ball to the receiver on the right side. 
What a game today. Number two, San Mateo against number three, San Francisco, respectively ranked in the state. San Mateo two in California and CCSF number three, Antienza. Ball placed at the 35, actually. Be careful of the 30. Block. So this will be a 40-yard attempt. Be careful in this type of game. A blocked field goal can turn the game around immediately. Christian Antianza, the kid out of Camp Melindo High School with a 40-yard attempt with four seconds. Yes. This is fun, man. Watch this, Mike. this is you fun. Watch this. Let's see what happens. The ball the crowd making some game. noise. Here's the snap. It is up. This one's got the distance. It is good. So Sandy College gets on the board before halftime to make it three to nothing on the 40-yard field goal from Antianza. And you know what? What a first half of football, Todd Spencer. We're talking three nothing, Mike. <laughs> Peter's motto every game, every day is just win, baby. Just win. If you've seen the movie Rudy by any chance. I've seen Rudy. I've, right. Absolutely. Who is the Rudy of the Oakland Raiders? A guy that may, may not have uh, the most skill, but has all the heart and soul. That's me. I'm Rudy. I'm the Rudy. Man. <laughs> first of all, the pride of uh, Polytechnic High School, San Francisco, a member of the USF Don's football team back in 1949-51, uh, then transferred to Tulsa, and a member of the San Francisco 49ers, inducted into the Hall of Fame 1990. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Bob St. Clair. Let's give a round of applause. <laughs> hey, Melinda, yeah, I'm with uh, quarterback Rich Gannon. Uh, we're live, by the way, and uh, good morning to you. Good morning. Go, Rich. Wow, tra training camp, uh, not a lot of fun, is it? A lot of work. 